Well, it is Tuesday, so it's time for our pet of the week, and we actually have two pets today, two dogs joining us, since we weren't on yesterday, right? You right, know, we've got right. two dogs yeah. in there. And I'm joined now by Sherry Calderon, your founder of Giselle's Legacy, yes. which is an all-breed animal rescue. Yes. Thank you for joining us, and thank you for bringing these pups thank in. Thank you for having us. Can you tell us a little bit about them? Yes. This is Peanut. He is a one-year-old Sharpay Terrier mix. He was rescued from the Riverside Shelter. He had been confiscated from a notorious homeless encampment where they were breeding and abusing mm. the dogs. And Peanut's foster, Elena, was one of the advocates responsible for shutting it down. And I can tell you, Peanut came right up to me. Even though he might have come from a hard background, he is very soft and sweet and friendly. He is amazing. He loves other dogs. He's great with cats. He loves children. He's amazing. So he'd be good in any type of home? He would be good in any home. And then we've got Peanut's friend here. Yeah, this is Lucky. He's between six or seven. He was rescued from West Valley. He was abandoned by his family. Um, they looked for him uh, the owners, he was there for a year, lost 20 pounds. Aww. He had given up and Giselle's legacy came in thanks to the volunteers and Megan at the West Valley Animal Shelter. And they came in, stepped in, saved him right before he was being euthanized. And anything we need to know about him, is he good with all types of families? He's or? good with families, he's good with other dogs. He lives with a dog now uh -huh. and is great. Um, I'm not sure about cats, but he is an amazing dog. And he was a little shy when I came up, but as soon as I gave him a treat, he was all about it. Yeah, yes. yeah. It just gives him a second because he was abandoned, so he's unsure. Yeah, and so if people want to adopt these dogs, what can they do to do that? You can go to our website, which is GiselleSLegacy.com. Um, so follow us on social media, uh, Giselle's underscore Legacy on Instagram or Facebook. Um, all of our dogs are listed on our website. And uh, we need fosters, adopters, yeah. donations, donations, adopters. anything helps. What yes. is the state of like our rescue shelters right now? You know, are you overrun with dogs? I know a lot of people got pets during the pandemic. Not everybody could take care of them. So what does that mean for you guys it's and what your shelters are like? It's never been this bad because of the pandemic. And so many people, when they went back to work, they abandoned or dumped their dogs back at the shelters. And the shelters have never been this crowded. Yeah. What inspired There's a waiting you to, list. There is a waiting mm -hmm. list. For them to surrender their dogs. Oh. So it's that bad. Yeah. And what inspired you to create this uh, rescue? It was the loss of my, my dear dog, Giselle, who was stolen. And I discovered later she had been murdered mm -hmm. by the person that stole her. And it was my search for her. Sorry, I get a little choked up. That opened up my eyes to the plight. And I have been rescuing animals ever since, and that was in 2008. And giving them a second chance. Yeah. And it's so, when you hear their, their stories and where they came from, and then when you end up seeing them with their loving home, that has to be really wonderful. And we want to put um, Peanut's info back on the screen if you're interested in adopting him. Remember, he's a Sharpay mix, and he's about a year and a half. And then Lucky, he's seven, and he is a Pitbull mix. Thank you so much for being here. And you can find out more about this on our website, kcalnews.com slash the morning wrap.